I think that's the courier. Open that door. Let's see what this is all about. <sighs> you know where this... Where it is. Yeah, there. Ah. A dagger of Dwemer origin. Keening. At least that's according to that. No, you fished off him. Ah, and you found some recipes for the Atronach Forge. Let's see what they are. This is for Daedric Boots. Um, well, at least we can understand what this recipe is. Soul gem. Must mean any soul gem. So just use petty soul gems for that one. You brought some amethysts and sapphires. Why not? Considering that summoning an unbound Atronach in the Atronach Forge manual probably works the same way with this recipe for fire salts. Sure, we need a sigil stone for this. I'd use it anyway. Let's see what this does. And we have fire salts. So if you use sapphires, you get frost salts. If you use amethysts, you get void salts. Let's see if that's the case. And it is! And another dragon is threatening the College of Winterhold! Yeah. Bad choice of... shout there. Um, yeah, those work better if it hits the dragon. That's more like it. I'll just use lightning storm. <laughs> Ooh, I think that dragon likes it. Give her a full dose of it. <laughs> oh, don't run away. He's got plenty more of that. <laughs> yeah. Yes. 
do us more than shoot lightning at it. Shoot crossbow bolts at it! One of Alduin's officers did you off. If this is the punishment job, where if you kill Nedra Snee, you get to live! If you don't kill Nedra Snee, you get to die, and he devours your soul. <laughs> to a high access point. That dragon isn't going anywhere. Not exactly what I was thinking of, but it'll do. Now it's time for Death from above! <laughs> yeah, it's his turn now! <sighs> doesn't that make you feel good, doesn't it? And yeah, I'm beating myself. Don't bother pointing that out. Um, there's a dragon. I'm a surprise. Turn to dust before. Got the soul you don't need, and keening. Something that he needs, so you best hand it to him. Perhaps we can go another few decades without a disaster. That would be nice. The dagger? Duh! By Akatosh, they didn't even wrap it correctly. You didn't touch it, did you? Well, no. Of course, you must have. Did you attempt to wield it? And you're not dead? Gods, it's a wonder it's in one piece. Now, now we see whether my theories are correct. I apologize if I have not been clear about my work. I didn't want to discuss it for fear this moment might never come. Everyone knows the dwarves disappeared. No one knows why. This little experiment is a first step in recreating the events of their disappearance 
in an effort to unravel that mystery. Lacking the heart of a dead god, I'm substituting the crystal you helped craft in its place. I also lack Sunder, the counterpart to the Dagger Kini. I am reasonably confident, however, that this will still work. I certainly don't expect it to have quite the same results. I'm no tonal architect, of course. Well, I suppose it's time, isn't it? Let's see what happens. You, uh, you may want to stand back a step or two. But please, don't leave. You've been instrumental in this process. I'd like you to see the results firsthand. Right then. Uh... Hmm, that... That didn't really do anything, did it? Perhaps a little harder. I don't understand. This should produce some notable effect. Work, damn you! Oh. He's... killed himself, Mom. No worse. He's in Keening now. With your help, he's turned it into a stubby version of the Soul Reaver! Oh yeah. But he's still trapped in there! What are we doing in Cunn's Grove? We need to find a way to get him out of there. Welcome to Cunn's Grove. If you want to do business here, you'll have to deal with me. If it's Malachite you're after, you've come to the right place. I'll pay for any you dig up out of Steam Scorch Mine. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. People say there's someone in Riften that can change your face. Make you look completely different. Do you believe that? So it seems the milk drinkers were right. That dragon was nearly the death of us. All we can do now is rebuild. Until next time. So I do it. Because I'm telling you to. I visited the meaderies of Riften once as a lad. Oh, wish I had their skill. Well, a lifetime of study, you might say. The best comes from Riften, but I haven't been there in years. Ever tried making your own? It's, uh, not easy, trust me. Yes, I've wandered a bit, but I always come back to Kynes Grove. My clan was one of the first to settle here. Legend says that my forefather, Lena, discovered the mines after he stumbled into a dark cave to relieve himself. Too much need. Of course, there's another story of Lena losing the family's shield in a different cave. So it depends on who you believe. According to my grandfather, at least, he swore that version of the legend was true. Even found the cave old Lena stumbled into. Hey, if you find it, I could show you some of the clan's favorite fighting moves. They're all shield techniques. Useful enough. Hopefully that story about Lena's shield is true. Right. 